Friday, Christmas Eve, Eve Day continues, uh, and Alert Day continues as well. Uh, take a look. Uh, snow and freezing rain potential, certainly the further west you go and south, uh, a higher incidence of freezing rain. Uh, the entire northwest region is a part of this. We've already had uh, airports completely shut down till noon when you look at SeaTac and Portland. There's going to be issues all day long when it comes to travel because of uh, not only the, the snow but also because a lot of people are driving and the passes are becoming uh, somewhat impassable in places. It's going to be all day today and into tomorrow morning. Winter weather advisory in effect till 4 a.m. Saturday. We're going to see that uh, throughout eastern, central, eastern Washington, North Idaho, and Montana. Doppler radar has been busy all morning long with snow. Now we see the backside of this, but there's going to be more coming in, and we're going to see that happen. Uh, wind chills feels like sub-zero because of the winds. It should improve through the day. We're going to continue to see uh, temperatures increase as the day goes on, even into tonight with temperatures uh, 16 to 18 degrees after the sun sets as warmer air slowly makes its way in off the west coast. Um, the snow forecast is going to be not daunting, but certainly impactful when it comes to your driving, uh, not only around town, but over the passes. And we're going to see that roll in. So anywhere from two to six inches of snow in many areas. So be prepared for that. Make sure your vehicle is prepared for that and that you have the necessary things inside your vehicle for making those, those trips. Saturday will be 30. Sunday 37, of course, that's Christmas with a chance of rain in the afternoon. And then we're going to have a pretty good chance of rain Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Uh, Wednesday, Thursday, maybe some light snow overnight as temperatures fall to at or below freezing again. Um, but this will be the warmest air we've seen in three weeks. So please use caution out there. We want you to be safe throughout the holiday season and um, take it easy. I'm Mark Peterson, the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Set. The First Alert Weather app would be perfect to have. All you have to do is go to your app store, download it, and get the latest version as well. Merry Christmas, everyone. We'll see you Monday morning. We'll continue to update this through the weekend.